Hello magical box lovers and welcome back to my channel. My name's Helen, I'm 44 years old and I live here in cloudy Derbyshire. <laughs> could be worse, it could be raining, but there we go. Right, so today another treat in store for you. I have got May's Witch Box, yay! I have to, I have to say before I get into the box, a huge huge thank you to Witchbox for supporting my channel um, I can't be believe what they went and did um, the emails that they send out to people um, saying that their boxes are on the way they actually included my channel on there and they also supported me on um, on Instagram, I can't believe it, I'm all made up, uh, they supported me on Instagram as well and I I couldn't believe it when I, I got the, the email, you know, like everyone else would do and there was, there was my face on there. So I was, I, I can't believe it, I really, really am a million percent grateful and thankful for Witchbox for supporting me. I've I'm only a very, very, very tiny, tiny person in the YouTube community. Uh, I have, two, I think it's 217 amazing subscribers and I love each and every one of you. And I think it's amazing that you've supported me in this way. It, yeah, I, yeah, I was overwhelmed when I saw it. And so thank you so much, Witchbox. Uh, you're the first company to actually do something like this and yeah thank you so so much uh, i can't say that enough so yeah <laughs> there we go that is not a paid promotion by which box by the way that it's you know i buy all my own boxes um it's it's just a kindness that they did to me uh, i think as like a thank you for me um doing videos uh, as i do because I, I do these videos because I, I love these boxes and I like to share them with like-minded people so you can see them and perhaps go, oh yeah, I'd like to try that company. Um, so yeah, so I just like to share my experiences and these boxes with like-minded people. So yeah, which box? Thank you so much. Right, so back to it. So this is May's subscription box for which box. So packaging as usual. I've blanked out my address and on it it does actually say which box in the tiny re uh, return label just there so just to make note of that that if you are a bit concerned about who may see it in your household other than that there's nothing really witchy on there other than their little logo there so it's not really obvious and in your face it's the tiny tiny return label so as always I have opened my box for safety's sake and because I can't wait to open it um, yeah this one I, w I was really really looking forward to because they actually issued a sneak peek and yes I was counting down the days after they'd issued the sneak peek <laughs> so here we go so this is uh, the subscription box for May and as usual, magical secrets lie within. That's their website. Just type in which box you will find them on YouTube, as well as um, Instagram, Facebook. They have a, a really good Facebook group, of which I'm part of. Um, yeah, subscribe to them. They've, not only do they do um, subscription boxes, uh, they've got a really really good shop as well so yeah so it's, it's not just a subscription service so as usual they've done a, a bigger sticker it's normally small if I remember correctly so yep so I have opened it but not done a, a mega good look I've just quick glance just to make sure nothing's broken just for safety's sake and um, plus you can't expect me to have a box for a few days and not open it there we go. Right, so let's open this one together. So as usual, we've got the information leaflet right on the top. I'll refer to that if I need to, but I'll try my best not to. So yeah, so it's your May box. So the theme for this month is, I can't say it, divinity. 
So you can see why I was super excited to get that. And they've also started including these cards now. Um, so it's a guide to how to get the best from your witch box, which is really, really helpful. I'll go into that in more detail. So I'm just going to get everything out as usual, and then I'll go in, in detail in, uh, one at a time. So these are usually either a spell or a ritual. And there we go. Let's scroll. I haven't opened this. I'm super excited for this one. Herbs. Ooh, I can see what it is from this side. I'm not, I'm not showing you that. Something big. I haven't opened this. I don't know what on earth that is. Because I don't read anything. Um, otherwise, it kind of spoils it a bit. These I did look at. I, I couldn't have them. And These were the sneak peek. I couldn't have them and not look at them. I'm sorry. <laughs> I'm honest. I'll let you guys know. I'm not going to say, oh, no, I haven't opened it when I have. <laughs> um, incense as usual. Uh, what have we got here? Candles, brilliant. <laughs> I'm trying to get it. It's like art print and ooh, stickers. Interesting. Uh, crystal. Oh, there's one more thing. Oh, an information card. Oh, that goes with the crystal. So I'll start with the crystal. So we've got snowflake obsidian crystal. It's an unusual shaped one. I have, I've only got one piece of uh, snowflake obsidian. It's quite, it's like a round one. So this is quite unusual shaped. I like that. I do love these. They just, they don't look real, do they? They look like someone's just splattered them. I love that. Absolutely beautiful. I, I want the, they are one of my favorites. My, my ultimate crystal is amethyst. Amethyst and then it's rose quartz and yeah. But these are up there with one of my favourites. So yeah, information card as usual always goes with that. So I'll pop that to one side. Um, so yeah, uh, I'll go through this card. So yeah, a guide to how to get the best from your witch box. So what they've started to do is they've introduced this. I think it was the last box. Um, so week one, it tells you to find out the phase of the moon for this month for the spell that's in the kit and uh, then display your art and um, it just takes, it goes week by week. So it's a complete month and uh, just so you can get the most from your box, giving you ideas. I mean, I've mentioned before what I do with my spell kits that I put them in a pile um, like in a special box and the ones that I'm the bath rituals in one box so they're next well they're in the bathroom to be honest so then i just grab them as i need them and then the others i, I put like in order of what i want to do next and um, so that i use them rather than putting them away in the cupboard then i'll not use them but this i have been referring to this in last month so it's very interesting so yeah so they started to include that which is really really good so yeah as i said the you get your inf information leaflet as usual each month you get one of these going through everything in detail i'll show you that that is their uh information to follow them just type in which box you'll find them there you go brilliant um candles <laughs> there we go so we've got white candles we've got them no that's the right way white candles plain white candles but a necessity white candles as you know the the universal candles uh yeah the, the what we need uh, i don't know why my screen's just gone really 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 dark i'm just going to put me on a pause and i'm just going to try and sort it out bear with me i'm back in the room that's better i just noticed i'm going it's going really really dark <laughs> There we go. I, I, I pressed a button or something. I don't know what I've done, but I've, I've sorted it out now. Uh, so, yeah, so candles, universal candles. Yeah, you always need white candles. There we go. I'll pop that back. 
So I'm interested with these. What are these? They're so all oh, the temporary tattoos. I thought they were just stickers. Oh, I like them. I keep saying, don't I? You know, with certain art prints, I go, oh, or, or the um, pins. Oh, they make nice tattoos. So the, I think they've listened to me. <laughs> I like that one. Oh, they're beautiful. I like those. How unusual. I've never had one of those in a subscription box before. I like that. I'll be having a go with those. Oh. How, how beautiful is that? Um, so it's an exclusive design by Ravenswood Manor for which box? That is beautiful. I love that. It says it all, doesn't it, really? It says it all. I love that. There you go. That's their details. They've got an Etsy shop, I do believe. Check them out. They are an amazing company. I love that. Uh, I've mentioned before that some of these... Um, I will use as a bookmarks and then others I will keep on my altar and frame this is going to be a, definitely be a, a framing one definitely I love that so what's this are we heard oh we're tea spiritual elixir tea so what have we got in in there I can't can't read the small print I'll just have a look in my leaflet where are we uh, so our blended tea is designed to lift the spirits and contains sensia green tea, cinnamon and apple. Ooh, there's some big chunks there. That, ooh, lovely. Oh, God. oh, I can actually just, just smell it through the packet. Lovely. And this, I showed you that way round. That is the, well, I think, it, yeah, it's the back. So that's beautiful in itself, but look what we've got, guys. We've got a necklace. We've got a goddess necklace. How beautiful. My hands are shaking. <laughs> that is beautiful. I love that. I love that. I'm thinking I might attach that. To that one i can't remember which company it was either which box or which casket i'm sorry for the opposite company <laughs> um but i got this it's a rose quartz with a pentagram and that was through a subs one of these subscription boxes um so i might actually attach that to that that'd be nice oh i love that oh. sandalwood incense I'm not going to open this because I've already got some sandalwood incense that is open. It smells divine though, doesn't it, sandalwood? I really love sandalwood. That is lovely. And the box is the detail that I love. When, when my camera plays, there we go. Look at that. They could just do a plain box, but no, they've, they've done the triple moon. Of course, it's the div divinity box. And it's an exclusive item packed by which box again. Advertise which box. Not promoted by which box, but there you go. Free plug-in for them. Um, so as usual, you've got your scroll. And this one is, I thought it would be, a list of all deities. There you go. So who have we got? So we've got... Uh, Bella Niles or Bell, Ahern, Frigg, Morrigan, Hathor, Nike, Janus, uh, Ast Astarte, Aurora, Ranwen, Caridwen, Cupid, and Matt. So a lot of different ones, not the not just the usual ones that you get. So interesting. I like that. I don't really lean towards any of the Egyptian um, gods, goddesses or any of um, their magic. I don't know why, it's just something that just does not spark with me at all. I'm not even, in, I haven't got even that um, interest there to want to learn it. So I, I just don't know why. Um, so um, I don't really know their gods and goddesses. I, obviously, the main ones I do know. But yeah, I'm, I, it's not my strong point. 
uh, but yeah, beautiful. I, I'm more Greek mythology. That is my um, strong point, is Greek mythology. It's the one that I've always, even from being little, I've always been highly interested in Greek mythology. Growing up with Clash of the Titans and Jason and the Argonauts and things like that. So yeah, of, of course, you know. <laughs> So I'll pop that to one side. So we've got the spell next. So we've got a glamour spell kit. Ooh. Just trying to open this up. Of course it had to have pink, because we've got a I thought it was pink, I? oh just pink plain paper. So we've got a even again. Because what I always do, I always write these out in my own handwriting because my writing is quite big. Um, and then I put them in a, a poly pocket with this card. Um, so then when I'm working by candlelight, I can just quite easily read it because I, I can't read that by candlelight. But I can read my own writing by candlelight. Um, and plus it, it makes it your your own you get to learn the spell or the ritual by doing it that way that, that's just my method you don't have to do it like that but yeah I always include these cards with that written bit in the poly pocket plus the poly pocket protects it you know if you spill anything I've done that we get oil all over the place it protects it and like I say I like to keep the cards with it so I know where the spell has come from um, so yeah glamour spell kit so this spell asks the goddess of beauty Aphrodite for assistance but you may vary this depending on your belief system this spell is best carried out on a Friday on or just after a new moon Ooh, contents a lipstick frankincense and myrrh incense cone, sheet of pink paper, a bag of rose petals. You'll also need a bowl or basin, a towel, pen or spring water. That's, oh, oh, they smell nice, the rose petals. We've got a... Oh, an instruction leaflet for the lipstick. That's good that they've put that because some people are allergic to certain um, ingredients in lipsticks. Um, yeah, incense cone. And we've got a lipstick. Again, I've never had a lipstick in a subscription box for a which one before? Top lips. I love that. Whoa. Because, I mean, I, the ones that I know, you can like write on the mirror and things with a lipstick. I don't know, uh, but yeah, that, that's interesting. That I'll definitely have a good read at that. I'm not going to read it out to you because I always encourage you to to go out and buy these boxes uh, to get the spells because they these companies have have made the effort. A lot of these are like family run or there's just like two people running them. Uh, they're not mass produced, so I always urge people to go out and, and buy the boxes so that they can get these rituals because they are absolutely amazing and they are they are worth the money. Uh, I just well, you can tell when I love them. I can't I can't hide my emotions very well. If I don't like something, you will see it, and if I do love something, you will see it as well. So yeah, love that. So we're on to the last three items. So I'm saving what I consider the best till last. So we've got white rose soap. Now I haven't opened this. I read what it was because I like what's that. I haven't opened it. Now I don't know, is it going to be in the shape of a rose? I'm presuming or It is in the so, uh, yeah. Uh, how? <laughs> how have they done that? It looks like a plastic flower. It's, that part is plastic. Boy, that is soap. How have they done that? That is amazing. 
Honestly, that is amazing. I don't want to use it. It smells beautiful. It smells fresh and clean and I just can't believe that. I didn't expect it to look like that. I thought it would look like soap that was moulded to look like a rose, not like individual petals. But yeah, it just looks like a fake plastic flower, but I assure you it's not. It's that the the petals is soap. I can't get over that. Yeah, white rose soap used in your ritual bath and for cleansing before spell work. And again, it's the um, ingredients on there. So I'm lost for words. I just can't get over the beauty of that. Because I do actually make my own soaps as well. So that, I, I, I've just got a silicone mould that I just pour the soap into. That, it just... I'm, well, I'm speechless. It takes a lot to make me speechless, but that's a work of art, that. I, I'm just going to see if the, if there's a company name on it. Um, no, a beautiful rose soap in gift box. Use a few petals in a ritual bath or shower to make you feel really divine. Uh, so, yeah, I, I can't actually see a company name on it, so... Whoever you are, amazing artwork, amazing. <laughs> this box, and I've still got two items left. So this one, I haven't opened this, I don't know what this is. Looks very nautical. Oh! And it says goddess on on it's made of wood it's obviously it's a pentagram but that's carved out of wood and yeah it's a long hanger but yeah very nau nautical theme to it i'll just hold it like that so you can see it better there we go that is amazing. Look at that, the detail. I love this ribbon. I suppose if you're not keen on the ribbon on it, you could take the ribbon off it and you could use that in like spell work as well. That's another good use for it. Oh, that is beautiful. Like even, even on the back is really, really pretty. get over this box this is the best yet the hanger is like a metal hanger so if you don't want all the rope um, you can just like take the rope off because where I'm going to pop it I might have to do that so I'll get rid of the rope and just pop it on a nail on the wall I don't know if you can see yet this looks like a little metal bit there so I'll take the rope off Pop that on the wall and you've got a beautiful, yeah. I can see it in my mind's eye now. That is beautiful, I love that. Very nautical, very nautical. I love that. Right, so save the best till last. The oracle cards. I have been naughty, I have gone through these. Because I knew what they were. But I will show you them one at a time. There you go. Look at these. So they are the Goddess Oracle cards, exclusive by Witchbox. That is the back design. That is the front. So we've got Frigg, uh, Diana, Frigid. Yep. Yeah. I'm trying to read it back to front. My favourite, of course. She is my, my goddess that I do pray to, is Hecate. 
although I do spell her name with a K, that is my, my preference. Everyone's different in, in their beliefs, but she, she is my goddess of choice. Athena. These are beautiful. Freya. Absolutely beautiful. So we have uh, one, two, three, four, five, six goddess cards. They are amazing. And these are what they sneak peeked. And it was the Hecate card that sneak peeked. And that is why I was like, I don't I couldn't believe these are absolutely amazing. Can you see how they're catching the light? Oh. This box. Speechless. This box is absolutely amazing. Everything in it has been amazing. Um, they've really... I love it. This month... They really up the game, up the game, a million percent up the game, and I'm not just saying that. Uh, I'm an I'm an honest person, uh, but yeah, brilliant, absolutely brilliant. I cannot wait till next month. I really cannot wait till next month. Thank you so much, which which box. This is amazing. And what would be nice is if they do expand these as well. And uh, now they've got the original, they've got the six cards. It's like uh, in the next few boxes, like perhaps do one card a month to get a big deck of all the goddesses. That would be good. And then you could also do the gods as well. There you go. That's a good idea. But yeah, I'd love them to expand on these because these are beautiful. Can't wait to use them. So I'm going to stop babbling because I'm just going to keep on babbling and gushing because this box, mm, beautiful. I love it. I love it. I love it. And as you know, I don't just say things. I I can't have my emotions. I really can't. I love this box. Which box? Brilliant. Thank you. I'm looking forward to next month. So yeah, I'm definitely going to shut up now. <laughs> So thank you so much for watching and thank you each and every one of you for taking time out to watch me and to subscribe to me and yeah, thank you so much and thanks again Witchbox, thank you. Uh, so yeah, if you have enjoyed this video then please like and subscribe uh, Yeah, and I will see you next time. Please stay safe, please keep your loved ones safe and I hope you have a magical week. Thank you very much for watching, bye.